Hi there, my name is Andre Schmitz and today I'd like to show you how to expand storage on an existing NetApp ONTAP Select installation. Have fun! So first of all, we go to our previously deployed ONTAP Select Deploy virtual machine and log in as administrator. So administrator account dot typo sign in and we're going to select our select cluster and first of all I'd like to show you how the actual storage situation is so far we are launching the system manager and have to log in there too looks good so far and after a little time of thinking he's there and we log in with our cluster administrator and sign in waiting until the dashboard is loaded Perfect, everything is fine. We are on NetApp ONTAP 9.6 RC1, going to the aggregates, and here we have our data 01 aggregate and our data 02 aggregate. And as you can see, we have four terabytes. And in our inventory, we can see eight disks. So back to ONTAP deploy VM. We click on the plus and say additional capacity of 10 terabytes. Select our storage pool. Provide the cluster administrator username and the cluster administrator password and click edit storage. So now we can see that there is something happening in the vCenter. Virtual machines are reconfigured for getting more disks. We go to our deploy VM and let's check how the status is and let's refresh on system manager. Now he isn't finished yet. Go back to deploy VM and let's see how the events look. Very good. Storage at disk assignment is in progress. So we'll give him a few seconds. Yep, and here we can see a new disk was created. Refresh, 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 refresh. Come on, guy. So normally uh, this should show you it will work in a few seconds. Here we are, new disks unassigned and the same seconds they were spare. That's one William DK. And we have not the message that he is finished yet. You can see it by going through a mouse over, storage ad is in progress. And in the events tab, storage at completed. Wonderful. So back to our system manager, refresh. We have two new spare disks. We go to our aggregate, data 01, add capacity. Here we see we have 4.2 terabytes and we have the possibility to add another 10 terabytes. That's Beautiful, perfect, add, fire and forget. That's it. And on the second aggregate, you see I have no option because I have not published new disks for that. So that's how easy it is.
refresh and we have 12 terabyte. Thanks for watching this video. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to use the comment function on YouTube or on my blog. Uh, hope to see you again. Bye bye.